Hello everyone, it's me Keith again. Welcome to another beginner's guide tutorial. This vlog is dedicated to all beginners out there who wish to know anything and everything about computers. So if you have something in mind, please feel free to comment it down below and we are going to create a beginner's guide tutorial for you. We are going to make this tutorial quick and easy to learn. Okay, so let's go. Hi everyone, it's me Keith again. Another Java tutorial for beginners. This time we are going to deal with control structures. Now when we say control structures in Java, it's like Java program is going to provide a decision making based on the user input. Okay, so some of the examples for control structures are if statements and if else statements are uh, there are a lot of control control structures out there however we are going to start with the very basic which is the if statement so it's like this same thing i'm going to use jdoodle.com for my online compiler so this is just the sample program that they have in here so i'm just going to remove whatever statements are inside so which is this one the example and the system that out that print line i think i'm just going to uh, leave it that way so maybe the statement should be removed or yeah the inner statement so i'm going to start here first is of course the initialization of uh, variables as well as the values of the variables so initialize variables and values there so it's like just a comment so int let's say i'm going to use age okay so for example if the age is equal to 16 if um, that person's age is equal to 16 then definitely he or she is still a minor so i'm going to provide a control structure here control structure will start here so i'm just trying to provide you an overview or a comment so let's say if um age is less than 18 which is 18 is the legal age for an adult especially if you're going to get an id so if age is less than 18 what will happen so this is the part where you are going to provide a statement so for this one i'm going to use uh this statement right here so i'm just going to remove this part this one i'm just going to cut this one up and place it inside our if statement there so what will be the argument for this one so if age is less than 18 i'm going to type in you are still a minor okay something like that so it's like just a decision making from which java program is going to decide that if the age of that particular person is less than 18 it will provide this statement you are still a minor okay so let's try that one this is just the very basic so i don't need to turn on interactive i'm just going to click on execute since i'm not using user input click on execute wait for the program to finish you are still a minor okay so why is it that you are still a minor it's because the value of our age is 16 which is less than what we are trying to state here on our control structure or the if statement Okay, so if ever I'm going to provide 19, which is not less than 18, if I'm going to execute it, nothing will appear. Why? It's because we haven't provided an argument that states or what will happen or what will your program display if that person is not less than 18. So that is the time that we are going to use the if else statement okay so to do that it's something like this since you are still a minor so what will happen next after i have 
printed out this one for minor, I can print another argument here known as else, okay? Then open it up again. Then this is where I'm going to type system dot out dot print line. So this is like it is a print line from which it opposes our first argument. So you are on legal age. You are of legal age. I don't know if the grammar is correct. Please correct me if I'm wrong. Age. Okay. So if it is not less than 18, then this should be the argument. So let's try to run that one. Click on execute. You are of legal age. It's because what we have inputted in here is 19. Therefore, it is not less than 18. So that person is already of legal age. Okay, so that is how you are going to deal with if and if else statement, which is the control structures for Java programming for the beginners. Okay, so that's it. Subscribe for more.